It looked more like a scene from a movie than it did a race. Looks like it's gonna be fun. They gotta be nuts. <laughs> But then again, it wasn't your normal race. It was crazy, mud puddles. It was uh, the Spartan it race. Just, it, it's really painful. To me, this is like recess for adults. Shane Clifford was one of the hundreds of racers in the first ever adventure race. He's done other things, like road races in the past. I really enjoyed it much better than a, a 5K race because there's, there's all these challenges just keep me on your toes. What makes the Spartan race different than normal races is the Spartan obstacles, things like jumping fire and throwing spears, climbing walls, and crawling under barbed wire. And just in case you were wondering, oh. that is real barbed wire. My personal favorite, the jouster that just uh, oh. come around the bend and there he is, ready to slam me to the ground. For me it was the pond, the water was it was deep and it was a long stretch of swimming with a lot of people. If all of this seems, well, crazy, that's how it's supposed to be. Race creator Salika Sevigny explains. Whatever your background is, you can do Spartan Race. And, and we're trying to invite people to be adventurous again, revive the age of adventure, honor, and glory. And if glory comes with battle wounds, then there was lots of glory out on the course. In total, there were 12 obstacles on the three-mile course and mud. Mud, and did I mention mud? All made easier by the oh, friendly race support. Break in the shade, get a little drink of water while you're down there. The prize for winning this Spartan Sprint is automatic entry into another race, the death race. You can use your imagination about what that is. But for most people, the Spartan race was about finding that inner warrior. I feel like a Spartan for sure, yes, 100%. Even if it is temporary. I'm ready for a shower. <laughs> In Williston, Mitch Pittman, Fox 44 Local News.